Budget woes impacting life in one of the valley's smallest counties. At Channel 5's Frank McCaffrey spoke to residents, then took their concerns to top Willacy lawman. Tomasa Rodriguez has lived in San Perlita for 44 years. She's now alone after her husband was moved to a nursing home. Her six children have grown and have moved on. Tomasa Rodriguez enjoys this house off Paloma Street in a rural part of Willacy. She takes pride in her home and neighborhood where she raised a family. I've always liked it here. Now, while she says this is a very peaceful part of the county, she says it would be nice if that peace were kept secure a little bit more. Rodriguez would like to see more Willacy County Sheriff's cars on her street during the day and at night. We need some more because sometimes things happen and there's nobody around. Rodriguez says her family members worry about her being alone in an out-of-the-way place without much protection. Yes, we are afraid because there's been robberies, not in my house, but with my neighbors. Channel 5 News reached out to Willacy County Sheriff Larry Spence to see what can be done to patrol the neighborhood more and make Rodriguez feel a little more comfort. He says he needs more funding for officers. His department has only 16 and more cars. He says of his 17 vehicles, most are over 150,000 miles and are old, dating back to 2009. He says his department's budget has gone up a few thousand dollars to just over $1.3 million a year. But he adds that's not enough to get new cars or hire new staff. But there is hope for growth in his budget. It's difficult, but now with the opening across the street here, uh, I think some more funds will become available. We, we still have the wind farms. Uh, those kind of held us over through this time, uh, held the county over. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm not saying there have been close the door on us at the county that they, they try to work with us. Spence adds for now his department is dependent on grants for its vehicles and the budget is used for its staffing. Spence says his department is making do with what it has but he believes the growing Willacy economy will allow him more budget to provide law enforcement on Rodriguez's street. Now Rodriguez says she looks forward to seeing it. In the Channel 5 News studio Frank McCaffrey Channel 5 News at 1030.